I hate to talk loud right now, but I'm flexing my muscles a little bit, trying to make myself look bigger than what I am. That's what people do. They posture. They try to make themselves appear to be more than what they are. Now, you're saying that it appears that I have a lot of white traits because I can speak English. Well, I was born in America. Look back there at that picture of Harriet Tubman, you know, on the Underground Railroad. Now, I am not educated by any means necessary. I am not. I am a person that learned how to speak. I did not learn anything from the educational system here in the great state of California, my 40 years on this planet. They could never teach me because they had problems with someone who had a state of mind. I would ask questions that I should not have been able to ask. When I was younger, I could spell words that were too long for me to even read. Understand this. They failed to teach me because I failed to graduate. I'm an uneducated person with a mind. Therefore, I am intellectual. The education in which I have, I obtained on my own. I don't read books. I'm sorry. I don't do, uh, what's the word, research to get to my points. I speak from basic built-in knowledge that was handed down from me through my ancestors. Let me flex again like I got muscle. I am just an individual who has a state of mind, who has the ability to speak. I am what some people would call a functioning illiterate. Honestly. I'm not trying to give myself this extra credit. I'm not Dr. Phil. My name is the real AIX. I can only speak from experience. So for you to say that I am educated, therefore I have white traits. Understand this, I am not educated. The knowledge in which you hear me speak of comes from inside me. Nobody gave me this. Nobody taught me this. This is what I am. And if that appears to be educated, what would happen if I could educate myself? If I could stimulate my mind to learn again? See, what stopped me from learning was the fact that I could not learn what I was being taught. It did not appeal to my brain, therefore it didn't stick. If I can analyze myself and I'm not a doctor, then what am I? Let me flex and make it look like I'm muscly. I am just an individual. I am. Therefore, I am. I think, therefore, I am. I think, therefore, I can. I am everything that is around me. Educated, non-educated, good or bad. I am. Can you understand what I am trying to tell you? I speak so simply that it seems that I am educated. I speak in a manner to where every single person who hears me speak can understand what I am talking about. That does not make me educated. That makes me different. For someone to have gone through the things that I went through in my lifetime and that can express them in a way that you can understand and think that I'm educated, that is a testimony to the human mind. I am, therefore I can. I am not the best, I am the greatest that there will ever be. Because if I ever believe I am what they have raised me to be, then I'm less than what you think I am already. I'm speaking loud on this one because I have to. Because the, the microphone is peeking all the way in the red and the camera goes blinky and makes it look like I don't understand what I'm talking about. And just in those little simple words in which I just spoke to you, I spoke in a circle. Non-educated. Those who have an education can see through me. 
those who don't think I have an education can't see that I don't have one. Those who know I don't have one cannot dispute the knowledge in which I have. Because if I had no knowledge at all, I could not conversate with those of a higher, quote unquote, so-called standard. It's the people I surround myself with that give me the knowledge to speak to those. It's the fact that when I was younger, I watched the news. It's the fact that when I got to a certain age, I understood that the news was not in my best interest. So the knowledge I have acquired is the knowledge from listening. Some say I talk too much, but in all this talking, I'm hearing what you're saying. In hearing what you're saying, that makes me understand how to speak to those who believe that I am beneath them. Now can you understand the level of my education? The battle scars and wounds from life itself have gave me the knowledge in which I have to speak to you right now. With these fans blasting because it's a hundred degrees. Wind barely blowing through the trees. People want to constantly put me on my knees. Bringing me to now. Why do I speak like this? It's my mind has grown. But my pockets stay flat. My heart is big, but my stop never quits. How can a stop never quit? Because I've never been allowed to go. So how far can I go? As far as my mind allow me to go. Allow me? No, will allow me to surpass what people think I am. To get my mind out of that mental traffic jam. To stop the frustration from one's simple thoughts, from the crimes, the lies, the schemes, the thieves, and the things that I bought, living and dying and dying and living, it's all in the same thing. The same theme, a thing. It's all the same thing. We strive to live and we live to die in the society that someone else has created teaching us that it is this way but it's this way everything that is right is wrong good is bad bad is good where is the frustration in the regular people who have the education what is this nation a nation of people who think and believe believe in what what they're told God will save us God is us we must save ourselves in order to see God. Those who live like gods reap the benefits of God. Those who have us work for them reap the benefits of God. What are we but pawns? An uneducated, mindless, senseless group of people who can't think on our own, clouded with drugs and deceit and need. I need this, I need that, I want this. All we need is ourselves. But all we need is our wants, our urges, our desires. And those desires have stopped me from learning. Those desires have caused me not to have an education. Those desires have me in a philosopher's mindset on a broke artist's budget. How can this wisdom flow from this volcano, which is human? The same way the salmon spawn every season. It is born within me, the knowledge that I contain. Sit back and uncloud your goddamn brains. Understand one thing, and one thing only. I'm not your friend, your brother, your sister, your mother, your pal, your friend, or your homie. I am you in my skin. I am what everything that you think I am. I am no more than a thought in your mind. I am a human being with desires to survive. I may not have an education, but the wisdom is divine because it was born inside of me and it resides in my mind. 
and you have been tubed, and I hope this 